Hey YouTube, this is Primetime Pokemon on my Primetime Walkthrough channel. Here with another Pokemon Black walkthrough. We're in Driftvale City. We just got off the drawbridge heading west from Route 5. There's, we're In this video, I'm basically going to explore Driftvale City, showing you everything to do in the city. And then, depending on how far we get, we're either going to go down to the cold storage and find Team Plasma. We might do that, and then the next step after that would be to battle the gym leader here. So, right away, this person here, if you talk to her, is, I was pretty excited about this. They call it the Charizard Bridge due to its elegant form. So if you follow me on uh, my primetime Pokemon channel, you know that Charizard is my favorite Pokemon. So that was sort of a nice uh, throwback. So we're going to go into the city here, and Charon, I believe, is right here. Yep. So there's Clay, he's the gym leader. And basically he's saying Team Plasma's Team Plasma guides uh, escaped when the drawbridge went down. So I have to go and find them. And they're down in the cold storage. So we have to go find them. And then we can battle Clay in the gym. So Charon's going to go ahead and we'll explore the city here. First thing we come upon here is, right here is a move tutor's house. So this person, depending on which Pokemon you chose to start with, either Snivy, um, Snivy, Tepig, or Oshawott, it'll, he'll teach you a move. And if you use it with another type of move, so you can cho choose these moves, you can choose Samurai, you can choose that. And what you can do, you can either learn Grass Pledge, Fire Pledge, or Water Pledge if you use more than one of them together. So if you get another one of the starters in this game somehow, either by trade, well, pretty much by trade, um, if you use those two moves together, they do 150 power each turn. But I'm not going to do anything like that now. I can come back and find them. So that's the move tutor's house. The next thing you can do is go up to the Pokemon Center up here. Here's the Pokemon Center. I'll heal my Pokemon real quick. You can also buy some things here at the Pokemon Mart. Heal my Pokemon right to the west of here. There's a woman who will give you a heart scale if you show her a Pokemon that you want. What a heart scale does is say you forget a move, a Pokemon evolves or levels up and, want, and learns a new move, but they and say that move you forgot, you want to relearn it. Well, if you give that Pokemon a heart scale, they can relearn one move they forgot, and then you can go to the Straighten City and per, give a, a heart scale to the person there, and they'll remove remember they'll teach your Pokemon a move it forgot before. So we can go in here and see what Pokemon the lady wants. Yes, I'd like to do you a favor. Oh, I can show that person. My Darumaka no strength. So I received a heart scale. So now I'm going to go over to the Driftvale Market. Once I go up here, I'm going to grab an item quick up here in the grass. Actually, let me see here. Actually, I don't think I can't get there yet. I don't have surf, so we'll go back. Back down here, we'll go down to the Driftvale Market, go to the west side of it, and a person there will be on their motorcycle and will learn how to do a triple battle. So there's a post person on their quick motorcycle there, Charles. Sure, I'll try a rotation battle. Sure, I'll try it. He's always full throttle on his Harley. I mean, his moped or whatever he has. Three Pokemon at once. I wonder what three Pokemon of mine will be out there. 
You have Samurott, Panseer, and Maractus. Oh, they're all level 27 too. Uh oh. I think my Pokemon are going to be gone pretty soon. But I'll use Water Pulse first on. Uh... Sure. I'll do it like that. Oh, not Basculin. That wasn't good. Oh, I confused it though. That's actually a lot better. Fight. I'll use Water Pulse. There we go. Super effective. Oh, all my Pokemon get experience then. It's a good way to level up Pokemon. I will use Slash, even though I might be going against a Striker. There we go. So actually in Pokemon Black you can learn a rotation battle and in Pokemon White you can learn a triple battle. And we'll use we'll use a water pulse against Substrika. Oh Lisa confused it though. Flame charge shouldn't do much to me. Will it increase speed, Rose? I will attack. I'm not going to rotate at all. So I'll just use Slash. Oh, use Spark. Hopefully it doesn't paralyze me. Oh, super effective. Critical hit. No! There we go. I was going to say, I'm surprised none of my Pokemon leveled up. Level 21 from Maractus. I defeated Motorcyclist Charles. Hopefully his crew doesn't come after me as, since he's a motorcycle driver. So, we'll go into here. And since I've seen so many Pokemon, I should be able to get Shell Bell. If I've seen 50 or more Pokemon. I believe... But let's take a look. You can buy many different things here. Moo Moo Milk. Charles bought everything for his loss, I guess. Talk to this person over here. Yes. Expert belt I received. So I actually, so I, I received that for having folk on higher than level 30. So you can get Heal Powder, Energy Powder, Energy Root, and Revival Herb. And sometimes places like this are actually a better place to get things like, instead of full heals or that type of thing, it's cheaper to get things here. So that does it for basically exploring Driftvale City. We have one more thing to do, and right to the east of the Pokemon Center, which is right here, I believe. No, oh, this is the Move Tutor's house. Nope, nope, nope. I'm getting all confused here. What we're gonna do is the Pokemon Center is where? Right there. So the house we need to go to is not this one. We'll catch this guy running though. Let's see what he's doing. Whoop. He wants to surf, I'll be looking forward to getting surf too. So in here actually, I think it was this one. There we go, I think this is it. There we go. 
So 50 or more, I get a shell bell. And what that does is if it's attached to one of your Pokemon, it, it heals one-eighth of the damage done to you. So basically, I think that's going to end this part of the video. I'm going to go to the Pokemon Center, heal my Pokemon really quick, and then I'll head down south to the cold storage area, battle some trainers, and find Team Plasma there. So that'll end this part of the walkthrough. I hope you're enjoying um, the different walkthroughs. I hope they're helpful for you. I'm trying to be as helpful as possible. And I'm also putting specifically what I'm doing in the descriptions and in the titles, so you should be able to easily find what you need to know how to do. Or if you're just playing along with me, that's cool too. So thanks a lot for watching. Once again, I'm in Driftvale City, and I'll be heading south to the cold storage to Battle Team Plasma. So thanks a lot for watching, and stay tuned for more videos. Thank you.